God created the cedar to store cosmic energy. When someone is in a state of love, they emit a radiant energy. It takes but a second, for it to reflect, off the celestial bodies floating overhead, and come back to earth, and give life to everything that breathes. The sun is one of those celestial bodies, and it reflects but a tiny fraction of such radiance. Only bright rays, can travel into space from man on the earth. And only beneficial rays, can be reflected from space, back to earth. Under, the influence of malicious feelings. Man can emit only dark rays. These dark rays cannot rise, but must fall into the depths of the earth, bouncing off its core, they return to the surface in the form of volcanic eruptions, earthquakes, wars etc. The culminating achievement, of these dark rays is their direct effect on the man, originating them, invariably exacerbating this man's own malicious feelings. Cedars live to be, 550 years old, day and night. Their millions of needles, catch and store the whole spectrum of bright energy. During the period, of the cedar's life, all the celestial bodies pass above them, reflecting this bright energy. Even in one tiny piece of cedar, there is more energy beneficial to man, than in all the man-made energy installations taken together. Cedars, receive the energy emanating from man, through space. Store it up, and at the right moment, give it back. They give it back. When there is not enough of it in space. In other words, in man. Or in everything living, and growing on the earth. Occasionally, though very rarely one discovers cedars, that have been storing up energy, but not giving back, what they have stored. After, 500 years of their life, they start to ring, this is how. They talk to us, through their quiet ringing sound, this is how they signal people, to take them, and saw them up, to make use of their stored up energy on the earth, this is what the cedars are asking with their ringing sound. They, keep on asking for three whole years. If they don't have contact with living human beings, then in three years, deprived of the opportunity to give back what they have received, and stored from space, they lose their ability to give it back directly to man, then they will start burning up the energy internally. This torturous process of burning and dying lasts 27 years.